PSG reached the Champions League finals. A historical moment. Congratulations! Who will be PSG's opponent in the finals? Who will Koeman sign first in Barcelona? What transfers are gonna be made soon? Subscribe on Football News and you will know it for sure. Guys, write your prediction in the comments on today's semi-finals match of the Champions League between Bayern and Lyon. And now, press like and let's get started! PSG reached the UCL finals for the first time in their history. Neymar assisted 24 times in the UCL, more than anyone since his debut in a tournament. A French club will play in the Champions League finals for the first time in 16 years. Tuchel reached the UCL finals for the first time in his career. Neymar has 59 points, 35 goals plus 24 assists in 59 games. Neymar reached the UCL Finals for the first time since he moved to PSG, faster than Barcelona. Lautaro Martinez was named the best player of the week in Europa League. Louis van Gaal may lead the national team of the Netherlands. Neymar? It's impossible to sign a player when the club doesn't want to trade him. We tried. Bartomeu announced. Tottenham announced the transfer of Joe Hart. A 33-year-old footballer made a deal with a club from London till the summer of 2022. Coutinho may stay. If the coach will make a decision that Felipe has to stay, he will stay, announced the president of Barcelona, Josep Bartomeu. Real's defender Jesus Vallejo will continue his career in Granada on loan till the end of 2020-21 season, an official website of Real Madrid informs. Messi, Ter Stegen, Griezmann, Dembele, De Jong, Semedo, Langlais are not for sale in Barcelona, announced Josep Bartomeu. PSG repeated Real's record scoring in 34 Champions League games in a row. Messi wants to retire in Barca. Koeman said that Lionel is the most important part of his project, announced Bartomeu. Ronald Koeman will become the coach of Barcelona, Bartomeu confirmed it. I was at Abramovich's yacht, Chelsea wanted to sign me, Tottenham refused, told Luka Modric. Barca will have to pay 4 or 5 million euros for equipment to the Royal Dutch Football Association. Rumors about Dybala's leaving Juventus is a lie. We are working on his contract extension. Go.com quotes Dybala's agent. Barcelona fired Abidal from his position of sporting director. Ter Stegen had surgery on his knee. He will skip two and a half months. One man in Liverpool has coronavirus. The team is training in Austria. Lazio made an announcement about David Silva's transfer to Real Sociedad. Bianco Celesti has been negotiating with the player since the end of July. I have found out about David Silva's transfer to Real Sociedad. I really respect him as a player, but not as a person. Sad sporting director of the Eagles, Igli Tare. There was no agreement with Lazio. My son is surprised with their reaction, announced David's father, Fernando Jimenez. Claudio Bravo left Man City. He won eight trophies for four years. Coronavirus in Marseille. An opening game of the season against Saint Etienne was postponed from August 21st to September 16th or 17th. Borussia Dortmund has 44 million euros of losses because of coronavirus. They had an income of 17 million euros last year. Douglas Costa is Sancho's alternative for Man United. Real and Borussia Dortmund agreed the loan deal of Rainier for two years. Wenger may replace Koeman in the national team of the Netherlands. Probably is the best Bayern team in history. It destroys opponents, announced Borussia Dortmund CEO Hans-Joachim Watzke. And now it's time for the main news. Let's go! PSG is the first team in the UCL finals. It was expected that Leipzig would fight and make a sensation, but it didn't happen. In the 13th minute, Marquinhos scored from Di Maria's assist from the free kick. In the 42nd minute, Neymar assisted to Di Maria. And in the 56th minute, Bernard scored from Di Maria's assist. Who is the man of the match? Of course, it's Angel Di Maria. A top-class game from an Argentinian. After the game, Thomas Tuchel argued with Leipzig's fitness coach, who looks like Robert Lewandowski. Even though PSG won, the situation was heated up and intense. PSG's head coach commented on the victory. 
I wasn't calm even for a second, but the way we defended is the most important to me. We had the great combination of decisiveness, will and quality. We stayed true to our style of the game. We tried to control the space and counter-attacks when we could. Also, we used dribbling of Angel Di Maria, Kylian Mbappé and Neymar. We haven't done a big tactical changes. Yes, we adjust to our opponents, but not too much. We have to show our strength and players demonstrate their desire to win, work together and endure. Football is for fans. We are getting through it together. We really feel that they are with us and they believe us. I hope that they will feel that this squad is a true team. Sad to hell. Leipzig's head coach Julian Nagelsmann said after the game. Paris deserved it to make it into the finals. In the first 10-12 minutes of the game we did well, had good moments. It was hard to come back into the game after the second goal, because PSG is a very quality team. It's hard to accept it, but that's football. After the second goal, our footballers lost faith in themselves. That's normal. It's hard to think about our great season in the Champions League, but everything is going to be fine in a week. It was a very successful season for our young team. We will try to do it again in the next season and we'll work a lot," announced Nagelsmann. PSG's president Nasser al Halafi shared his thoughts about entering the UCL finals. It's a historical evening. We entered the UCL finals for the first time. The players had a great game. It's an amazing night. And with an uneasy opponent. You know, fans for me are very important. They are not here, but I know they are with us. We have been waiting for this victory, for this historical evening. This one's for you, fans. Our dream is the Champions League title. We are close to it. I told the players, today you had a great match, but we can't stop. We want to win in the finals. I'm not talking about the result, but my players want to give it all. I'm very proud of them, said Al Khilafi. Neymar was very emotional after reaching the finals. Just look at this photo. This victory means a lot for a Brazilian. Also, he trolled Leipzig with his post on Instagram and had fun in the locker room with Kylian Mbappé. Final! Final! All in all, it was very cheerful in PSG's locker room after the final whistle. Guys, if you want quality content and important news, subscribe on our project called We Know Football. The link is in front of you. Click and watch. That is all for today. Bye-bye.